So tangent is square root of 3 on the unit circle at pi over 3. But remember, we are going all the way around the unit circle, um, not just one answer, but we want all the answers on a, on a trip around the unit circle. So it's not just pi over 3. But where is the other place that tangent would be positive? 4 pi over 3. 4 pi over 3. Because tangent is positive in quadrant 3. So that would be at 4 pi over 3. Okay. So the next one, what do you think I should do first? Change cosecant. Change cosecant. So I'm going to, I'm going to leave 4 sine theta the same. I'm changing cosecant to 1 over sine theta. I'm not, instead of changing both sides, what? Multiply both sides by sine. Excellent. Multiply both sides, both sides by sine. And I'll tell you why. Because if you're not sure what you would have done, I'm trying to solve for theta. And if I'm going to solve for theta, I need all my thetas together on the same side. So I'm going to multiply both sides by sine theta. Because that will clear this fraction off and it will move my sine thetas all to the same side. So now I have sine theta times sine theta. So I have 4 sine squared theta equals 1. Now remember, the whole goal here is to get theta by itself. What should I do now? Divide by 4. Okay, now I have sine squared theta equals a 4. But I can't solve that either. I need a sine theta. Take the square root. Take the square root of both sides. That gives me sine theta equals, what's the square root of one fourth? One half. A half. But don't forget, when you take a square root, there's actually two, two answers. Positive. positive and negative. So it's positive and negative one half. Now, where is sine a half? Five or six. And in this case, I need, them, I need all the answers, positive and negative. So I need every place on the unit circle that has a 6 on bottom. So that's quadrant 1. What would it be in quadrant 2? 4 over 5 pi over 3. 2 pi over 3. 5 pi over 6. <laughs> it needs a 6 on bottom because that's the point. It needs a 6, six on bottom. It would be 5 pi over 6. Is, is sine positive in quadrant 2 or, or negative? I'm going to group them together. So it's, sine is positive in quadrant 2. All students? <laughs> So this is 5 pi over 6. What about quadrant 3? 7 pi over 6. 7 pi over 6, and that's where sine would be negative. And what about quadrant 4? 11, 11 pi over 6. 